This week, we considered the many layers of transitioning into a postdoc position. You reflected on how your identities intersect with your role as a postdoc and how the postdoc role differs from the experiences you had as a graduate student. This module reminds me of my own rush to independence as a postdoc. I thought I was expected to be able to do everything by myself, even though I had just joined a new group and was doing different things than I had as a PhD student. I think my former postdoc self could have learned a few things from this module, especially the section focused on developing and communicating expectations. Additionally, as you have learned, your role in your new postdoc position will change rapidly as you progress through your training. You might find new projects and collaborations to begin, have students to mentor, or even be teaching for some classes. Just remember that you are not alone and that you can rely on your network you have built from your PhD work and your current postdoc environment to help you navigate this exciting chapter of your career. You also identified your goals and expectations and mapped them onto a timeline. This will be a useful thing for you to continue to return to, helping you reflect on whether and how you are achieving your goals. You can also use this exercise to facilitate ongoing conversations and check-ins with your mentor. Don't forget that you built a network to examine the dynamics within your community of practice. Continue reflecting on your role in that community as you become an active member, contributor, and leader. In my current postdoc position, I truly enjoy being a leader of our postdoc committee, putting together workshops and social events to help connect our postdocs and learn more about each of them and their needs while also learning a lot about myself. Your postdoc is an important time for you to develop new relationships and forge the connections that will help you throughout your career. Be sure to get involved any way that you can. After this week, we hope you feel more confident about your position as a postdoc. We hope your reflections will lay the foundation for continuing to think about your postdoc as a tool for your career development.